Galileo Galilei, the father of modern science, early life and education. Galileo Galilei was born on February 15, 1564, in Pisa, Italy. He was the first of six children born to Vincenzo Galilei, a renowned musician and music theorist, and Giulia Romanotti. From a young age, Galileo displayed an innate curiosity and an aptitude for mathematics and natural philosophy. His father recognized his potential and encouraged him to pursue his interests in science and mathematics. Galileo's formal education began at the age of 10 when he was sent to a local monastery to receive an education in Latin and literature. In 1581, he enrolled at the University of Pisa, where he initially studied medicine as per his father's wishes. However, his interest in the natural world quickly drew him towards the mathematical and physical sciences, contributions to astronomy and physics. In 1585, Galileo's fascination with the motion of a swinging chandelier in a cathedral led him to investigate the pendulum's behavior. This marked the beginning of his scientific inquiry, and he started to question the Aristotelian model of motion. Galileo's innovative ideas and experiments on falling bodies, projectile motion, and the nature of light laid the foundation for his later work. One of Galileo's most significant contributions to astronomy came in 1609 when he heard about the invention of the telescope. He immediately set out to improve and build his own telescopes, which he used to observe the night sky. Galileo made a series of groundbreaking discoveries, including the four largest moons of Jupiter, now known as the Galilean moons Eo, Europa, Ganymede, and Callisto. These observations provided compelling evidence that not all celestial bodies orbited the Earth, as the prevailing geocentric model suggested, but rather the Sun. In 1610, Galileo published his findings in a treatise titled Sidereus Nuncius Starry Messenger, which catapulted him to fame across Europe. He was appointed court mathematician and philosopher to the Medici family in Florence, solidifying his reputation as one of the leading astronomers of his time. Conflict with the Church Galileo's advocacy of the heliocentric model, which placed the Sun at the center of the solar system with Earth and other planets revolving around it, brought him into direct conflict with the Roman Catholic Church. The Church supported the geocentric model, based on ancient teachings, as it aligned with its religious beliefs. In 1616, the Church issued a decree that declared the heliocentric model as formally heretical and forbade Galileo from teaching or defending it. Despite this, Galileo continued his research privately and wrote extensively on the subject. Dialogue concerning the two chief world systems Galileo's most infamous work, Dialogue Concerning the Two Chief World Systems, was published in 1632. In this book, Galileo presented a dialogue between three characters debating the merits of the heliocentric and geocentric models of the solar system. While Galileo intended the book to be a neutral discussion, it was perceived as educating heliocentrism and contradicting the Church's teachings. As a result, Galileo was summoned by the Roman Catholic Inquisition in 1633 and faced charges of heresy. Forced to recant his views, he was sentenced to house arrest for the remainder of his life. During his house arrest, Galileo continued to work and made significant contributions to physics, including the study of motion and the law of falling bodies, final years and legacy. Galileo's health declined in his later years, and he gradually lost his sight. However, he remained active in his scientific pursuits until his death on January 8, 1642, in Ossetri, near Florence, Italy. Galileo Galilei's contributions to science were immense and far-reaching. His work laid the foundation for the scientific method, promoting observation, experimentation, and logical reasoning in scientific inquiry. His discoveries in astronomy and physics overturned long-held beliefs and inspired future generations of scientists to pursue knowledge fearlessly. Posthumously, Galileo's reputation was rehabilitated, and his work became increasingly recognized and celebrated. His ideas were fundamental in the formulation of Isaac Newton's laws of motion and universal gravitation, which revolutionized physics. 
Today, Galileo Galilei is remembered as the father of modern science and is celebrated for his remarkable achievements in astronomy, physics, and the scientific method. His legacy continues to inspire scientists and thinkers worldwide, reminding us of the power of human curiosity and the pursuit of truth.